Let's quickly look at sessions of Express. Well, the main difference with cookie and a session is session is actually stored on the server side. And well, the session middleware must come after the cookie parser and cookie parser is needed for the session to work properly. So because session objects look up for the cookie for matching up the requests, so we need cookie parser. Session middleware has a secret key which is used as a hash. So rest all is simple. Just use the session dot session name and store, some, store something. In this case, a simple string passed in by the user. That is request at params dot user. Now once the user clicks on slash user, let's send request.session.name. Remember session is present only on request objects and not response objects. So this is it. This would set, this would output the session name value. Well, I think there was an error there. Yeah. Well, we need to have response object dot send. And as I said, session is present inside request object and not response object. So change this to req. Now let's have a look. So the server restarted automatically. Let's navigate to localhost port 3000 slash user slash some name. Now if you click, you have the session being read back out of the session variable. Here we are storing simple string. You could go ahead and store some of the complicated things like some structured data inside this session variables. Also to destroy the session, you could use request.session.destroy. For code about logout that is destroying the session, please visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video. Please share this video with your friends on Google+, LinkedIn, Twitter, StumbleUpon, Facebook, etc. Stay subscribed to technotip.com and don't forget to like this video on YouTube.